The overall goal of this procedure is to easily and reproducibly grow bacterial biofilms in a 96-well plate format on lid-attached pegs for antibiotic susceptibility testing using a viability dye. This method can help answer key questions in the antibiotic discovery and development field by exploring activities on biofilm-associated cells, which are often more representative of in vivo infection states. The main advantage of this technique is the ability to easily challenge preformed biofilms in a medium throughput assay and determine inhibition using a common viability dye. To begin, Grow a culture of biofilm-producing organism in a nutrient-rich medium. Inoculate the Staphylococcus aureus strain Newman from a glycerol stock in 10 milliliters of Mueller-Hinton medium. Perform all work involving handling of S. aureus with gloves and within a biosafety cabinet. Incubate for 16 hours at 37 degrees Celsius on a rotary shaker. Add the calculated culture volume to a centrifuge tube and pellet cells by spinning for one minute at 10,000 Gs. To prepare the biofilm inoculum, aspirate the spent growth medium and resuspend the cell pellet in 20 milliliters of CRPMI. Using a 200 microliter multi-channel pipette, add 125 microliters of inoculum from a 25 milliliter reservoir to each well of rows A to G of the bottom plate. Fill 125 microliters of sterile CRPMI medium in each well of row H as a sterility control. Take the peg lid and hold it above the plate bottom with a peg